Good morning guys, so it's Sunday, I'll be doing a vlog. Um, I have some oats here that I'm gonna eat. It's very late, but I'm hungry and I plan to eat this from yesterday, so we're gonna do that now. I'm also gonna put some granola in my oats, that's my style. I needed some bread yesterday and I put oil on it I put gloves on when I'm kneading because my nails are um, not a good combination because I'm think I'm gonna make something um, I'm gonna make something in my air fryer and I'm gonna put strawberry jam and I'm gonna put almond butter I think that would be cool um, I think I'm gonna actually wait no I'm not gonna use all of it I'm gonna have Kyle buy me some chocolate. So I washed my hand like literally just a while ago. Um, this is what it's looking like. I think it looks really good. I can't believe I needed this. I'm so proud of myself. Um, I'm trying to not get my nails to, to really touch it. So that's what it's looking like. So like I said, I'm pretty proud. It's not really sticking or anything. I put oil on it to preserve it, but I'm gonna do the thing now. And actually gonna get some peppermint this is me in quarantine by the way <laughs> gonna make some tea and yeah this is literally what I've been eating the past couple days don't judge me it was just the simplest thing that I could order um Kyle said he's gonna get me the groceries which I really appreciate but here we go This water has been boiled twice, so yeah, this is definitely some hard water. Oh, Jesus Christ, the steam, oh my God, why the steam really get to me? <laughs> my, by the way, my suitcases are still right here, I'm not going to unpack them because it's just unnecessary. I left clothes in my closet, so I'll be utilizing those. Not the steam burning me. Um, I think this is good enough. Oh, I actually have milk. I have some condensed milk. Ching. Ashley, she's a content creator, a British content creator. Um. Okay, so we're back at the hotel, and I'm just gonna give you guys a little tour this before we like, hit the road to Stone Town. Don't watch the fact that I'm in the Zanzibar. Same. Don't watch the fact that That's I'm in the really same cool. old outfit because. My music is never that. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
I just took the lid off my rice um, and it is done. So it's very hot, but it's very soft and nice. I still have some more chicken, so I don't think Kyle's gonna get here anytime soon. Um, with my groceries so i'm just gonna warm up some chicken and eat with my rice and this rice is cooked with nothing but steam i think i over i did too much water so i don't know if i should turn it on for maybe another two minutes i'm gonna test that out and then let you guys know i actually don't think i'm gonna um turn it on for any much longer i feel like it's quite perfect it is very sticky like i could make sushi with this rice but um, I am gonna eat some. It's honestly me alone. <laughs> Nobody else is gonna eat this rice but me. And not bad. If I had butter, I would have put butter. But I used to never put anything on my rice because I honestly. I did not find I didn't find it necessary. I didn't find it necessary at all. Like not everything I don't know, it tastes fine to me. It tastes quite alright. So I just didn't do that. The girls that get it get it. And the girls that don't don't. So I think I'm gonna warm up this piece of chicken. What is it looking like? And yes, I was munching on some chicken last night, so I'd already bitten into this. So I'm gonna continue on with that. If I get hungry for more, I don't know, this is a pretty decent piece, so I don't think I'm gonna overeat. And the reason why I got this is because I knew it was gonna last me a good time. I got some mashed potatoes, which I'm gonna just scoop on out. Um, gonna warm both of that up for like two minutes and 15 seconds. And then I'm gonna put my rice in the mix. gonna put my rice in the mix move this out the way I don't want to keep it warm so I'm gonna turn it off because I found out that when you put the setting on keep warm it's going to only dry out it's only going to dry out the rice so because I don't want to do that. I'm not going to do that. So instant pot, I have the air fryer. And I really like it. I like their home appliances. So we're gonna warm that up and then I'll be right back so this is what dinner is looking like more or less I don't normally drink um, Pepsi that often um, unless I go out and someone asks me what I want to drink or at KFC or something so I'm also gonna eat this with some coleslaw i'm not really normally a fan of coleslaw either but lately i just started eating it a lot a lot a lot if that makes sense like a lot a lot a lot Ooh. so let me grab my plate i'm gonna just dish out my rice 
and you guys know this is really a very hefty meal <laughs> this meal is hefty let me squeeze some of this chicken and then i'm also gonna put some because i like ketchup on my white rice and if you don't that's more than okay normally i wouldn't eat with a spoon either but it's a bunch of changes going on this is what it's looking like hope i don't spill anything off my plate this is a big plate of food i'm not gonna lie to you like even me looking at this now is a huge plate of food but yolo <laughs> all right guys bye good night guys it's actually way past my bedtime but i figured that i would i don't know try and make the thing that i was telling you about this morning i think the dough is actually getting a bit too hard um i'm actually watching something as well on hbo it's called hold on mayor of east town i think that's what it's called yeah mayor of east town it's a series about crime small town murder mystery crime um i already washed my hands and everything but like i told you earlier i'll be using gloves just because my nails are long and i just don't like anything getting stuck underneath my nails um yeah i've already have my air cooker right here i think i'm only gonna use one gloves and i'm gonna pull out i'm gonna use a butter knife don't need anything too sharp and i'm also gonna pull out a spoon just so I can go back and forth from the peanut butter and also I'm going to dust this flour, this plate a little bit I think that's a good amount flour this plate um, I'm going to have to use my other hand but not to do it or anything whoa it's super duper tough oh my god look guys dang yeah i'm just gonna have to use this hand to squeeze and do all these things i'm just using this hand as a base try to keep it away from my nails This is a quarantine vlog because I, I just don't know what to do with myself. I'm going to use enough to make like, let's say six balls of something. Alright, so flatten it out. Basically like dumpling, right? Yeah, I should have got another glove for this hand. But my fingers are clean. Alright. I'm gonna start off with. Oh my god! Yo, I just opened this yesterday. I literally just opened it yesterday. I'm gonna start off with this. Ooh! It's actually a mess in here. This is strawberry jam. A lot of the oil settled at the top. Well, not oil, but I haven't used it. But it doesn't expire for a good while. I'm going to put some of this inside. Then I keep stretching it, keep stretching it. I saw, I saw someone do this with Pillsbury dough. So that's why I'm kind of confident that... I can do it, but Pillsbury dough is much sweeter than the dough that I have made from scratch. Because I didn't know you 
could like put white sugar in those things. I think that's a good amount. I'm gonna fold it into itself like dumplings, Chinese or Asian dumplings. But I think I put way too much and now this, the, the shape is getting weird. Oh my God, hold on, uh oh. Oh my God. God, God, God. Oh my God. Guys, I flopped. The shape is getting really weird. Oh my goodness, my strawberry. Maybe I should just use another one. Nah, I don't want it to be too powdery. Oh my goodness. You're watching me fail firsthand. Okay, I have to take out some of this. By the way, there. You know what? The first ones never come out the best. Oh my god, this is so weird. <laughs> This is so weird. It's not sticking like. Oh my god, I know there's a big old blotch. Yeah, this is weird. I'm trying my best. At this point, I think I'm about to take the gloves off. <laughs> this is not how it was supposed to look. What is that? Should I just make a big thing? I'm just gonna keep folding it into itself. Forget if my hand gets messy. I'm making dumpling in the morning. <laughs> I'm just gonna do two. My nails are completely messed up. This actually looks shagged up, but let's see. We're gonna turn up the time to nine, let's call it 10 minutes. Bake at 400 degrees. And let's see what's going on. Okay, so I think these just basically told me to go to my bed. Because what are those? <laughs> I actually cut one in half and it wasn't, bad let me show you which one where is it i just don't think i think it's too thick and i think it's better if it's fried in oil it didn't look bad and it doesn't taste bad let me see about this i'm gonna look up how to make a croissant all right so yeah sorry my camera Yeah, it's definitely not baked all the way. Cause, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I really don't know. But, I feel like the concept isn't a bad one. Maybe I could have turned down the time. I'm not going to eat this. I don't want to get sick tomorrow. Um, yeah, these pieces are nice. The concept itself isn't bad. It's just that maybe I should turn down the temperature and have it bake for longer. So maybe... Keep it at 350 and then have it bake for let's say 20 minutes. Yeah. The ball. Oh, yo, that sounds hard. This was um much smaller than the other ones. I'm glad I didn't do all of it, so I can definitely make some dumpling tomorrow. This is what this is looking like. 
Wow, this is tough. It's not baked all the way either. Shite. Five second rule. Doesn't look cooked all the way to me. Definitely not cooked all the way. Peace. Good morning, guys. As you can see, I am warming up something in the air fryer. <laughs> It's very convenient when you don't want to turn on your oven really quickly. I've already did my skincare routine and all that good stuff. And I'm also drinking some water. I'm trying to get back on my water drinking routine. So I'm trying to have at least four glasses of water a day. Um, I want to pace myself to make sure because I tend to pee a lot when I drink water. And that's just not a vibe. Um, so yeah, at least four. Uh, let's see if I can have eight glasses and yeah while the chicken is warming up I thought it would be cool to probably mention that I think I want to turn some of my pictures into like wallpaper um, and maybe sell them for like a dollar a dollar ninety nine to you guys I have some beautiful drone shots that would be amazing that I can turn into wallpapers especially of Jamaica and you know some beautiful pictures like even this this is Port Royal so let me know what you think about that I mean it's a dollar for wallpaper I don't know if you think that's cool or if you think that's doing too much but let me know and I'll look into how to make them and they'll, they'll be digital so it'll be easier um, to get to you uh, this is the edit that I did and um, yeah I don't know let me know what you think by dropping a comment down below it's even used as my home like home screen image so let me know what you guys think if I should go into that and I can get that ready for you while I'm in quarantine <laughs> Door dashed. I do have light. Door dash. Really? Door dash. <laughs> this is Uber Eats. <laughs> wow. <laughs> All right, get to work safely. I told Kyle what I needed, and he delivered. Of course, I gave him the money that he used to pay. So we're gonna do a unboxing. Huge bag of things that Kyle brought me. Um, first things first, I definitely needed some hand towels. Um, I'll be unbox unpacking everything with you guys. This is my little paper towel holder. It's been empty the past couple days, so we finally got something in it. Got bread. <laughs> Of course, some really nice whole wheat bread. I haven't been eating bread for a while, but that strawberry jam really had me on a chokehold. And I also have almond peanut butter or almond butter, so I'm really excited to try that. Got a dozen eggs. Got some butter. We got some mayonnaise. We've got some tomatoes, green pepper, which I think I'm gonna wash all these things. Well, I'm definitely gonna wash all these things tonight. Got some ginger, probably can't see it that well, but also we've got two onions. We've got potatoes. Um, silk almond milk, perfect, perfect. Four rolls of tissue, God knows I needed this. Four rolls of tissue, I'll put these right here. Um, two canned uh, mixed veggies, so really, really nice. I can make some potato, I can make some pasta. I have 
obviously the potato i've been had pasta and i have the mayonnaise all i needed was mayonnaise and the mixed veg so nice also have some scallion um got some carrots that i can juice just for like a little one cup or two cup of juice um got some more carrots this i'm gonna put in my um curry chicken along with the potato and i've got some orange juice well it's orange pineapple so this is really nice the only thing i'm missing that i asked for he said he's gonna try to get me tomorrow because the location that he went to didn't have any is the chicken breast um the tube of yogurt and some almond joy not almond joy some um chips ahoy cookies chocolate chip cookies and i have this great new bag to add to my collection so yeah just want to tell kyle thank you he already heard it but i know he's gonna eventually watch and see my fridge is so empty and sad so i'm gonna pack all of these away and yeah, I'll see you guys later. This is oh. Nah. evening guys so i'm making some chicken stir fry and this video won't be as pretty as the breakfast video because honestly i just want to make something to eat just chill relax by my lonesome you know just enjoy this time to myself i don't have a walk but i do have this very nice um cast iron pot that i'm gonna use as a substitute um so like i said it won't be as cinematic and beautiful as this morning but i'm doing my best <laughs> um i have some cut up vegetables here i got my soy sauce um mixture with brown sugar and other things uh, i have extra soy sauce here if i need it my vegetable oil and i'm also going to do some uh fried rice i have some leftover rice from like two days ago um so i'm gonna make use of that rice and i've got water here i try to keep my water in the fridge ah. 
yeah so and i also have my egg for my fried rice but for now i'm just gonna do the chicken put it aside warm up the rice and have my dinner i will come back and show you guys what that's looking like and i have more stuff to do this again so maybe in two days i'll make a more cinematic one and you'll see that at the end of the video to turn on the camera to show you how the chicken came out so this is how it looks this right here is some sugar so don't think I burned any of the chicken I didn't it's literally just some sugar from the bottom of the pot but this is what it's looking like I think I did a pretty good job okay, guys so at the end of the day this is what it's looking like I'm boiling water so I can set some ice tonight and I'm gonna drink water you definitely heard my um, previous glass break. I'm so heartbroken. Whenever glass breaks, I, I, I'm I just internally really sad. I don't know, I just don't like glass breaking, but the cross is broke, so then move on with our night, and now I'm truly gone. Peace out. Good morning, guys. It's literally been two days since I've vlogged, but I've got my life together. I've spread my bed, washed my face, I'm actually, my face is dry now, so I'm gonna put on my skincare products. Um, I was just talking to myself, so I was like, why don't I just talk to the camera? Um, I'm going to edit, and I thought it would be perfect to, I don't know, just talk to you guys a little bit while I set up this guy. Let me show you what's very important for my editing. An external hard drive. If you don't have an external hard drive, and you're editing and you find that you keep running out of space for the longest time I've had an external hard drive and I did not know that I could edit off of my external hard drive for example let me show you what I'm talking about the Mac M1 then you don't have to worry about this piece this piece is just because Mac is taking the piss and it's taking also a lot of money so <clears throat> this is just an adapter for my computer yeah so you won't need it if you won't need it plug in my computer <coughs> and it'll pop up soon it doesn't take long it's basically another location on your laptop so I click it and obviously you can store files, you can store pictures, videos. It's just an extra memory space. But I have Final Cut Pro and if you have iMovie or if you have Premiere Pro, then um, it works the same way. I just save my work to this hard drive. So when I click, and mind you, this hard drive has four terabytes. Four terabytes. Do you know how much gigabyte that is? How much is one TB? One, just spell it. Yeah. A thousand. One 
terabytes is 1,000. So we have 4,000 gigabytes, guys, to edit and to do as our mind pleases. So that's what I'm gonna do. Um, yeah, if you want a video on me editing, like a more interesting video <laughs> than a sit down video, then let me know. This is what I did for my, my reel. It came out so nice. I'm gonna start editing my reels and my TikToks on the computer because the quality is just so much better when I film it on my camera. It's just such an extra step, but for content and to improve quality, I'm willing to take that extra step for you guys. So make sure you're following me on TikTok. All right, guys, I'm about to go. This vlog is about to be long. About to be a long vlog, so peace out.